Hi everybody, Philip Goodman here from the Nevada Real Estate Group at Keller Williams Group One Inc. in Reno, Nevada. And I'm here today with Sabrina Karstensen, our Gardnerville Minden Topaz expert. How have you been, Sabrina? I've been good, how about yourself? I, I've been quite well, thank you. It was a very busy summer selling and buying season. It has. Uh, and October was still a busy one too. So let's dive right into MLS and see exactly what happened in October down south. Sounds great. Sabrina, we're first looking at the 2018 October sales data here on the top, and then down here the 2017 October sales data. A couple of quick things to point out, 83 units sold in 2017, 80 in 2018. Sabrina, let's talk about the median price. How are things trending? Well, compared to last year, we are at 14%, um, as you can see. In 2017, 97% of asked price was received, whereas this year we're receiving 97.5%. So like you said, it's eerily close. And that half a percent, uh, is there anything we can attribute that to? In the, the difference of uh, what the sellers are asking for and what they're actually getting? Well, that's the thing. Sellers and agents are doing a better job at valuating properties. Thus, we're seeing less price reductions now in October of 2018. Let's talk about days on market. We typically think that if a property is on the market too long, something's wrong with it, or sometimes the property is so good it, it it's not on the market very long, but are we seeing any sort of correlation between days on market and median prices? Uh, not really. And that's, uh, that's the difficult thing. And the tricky thing about our market is there's really no rhyme or reason as to why a home is sitting on the market for 80 days, whereas another one sells for in five days. It's, it's really difficult because a price, a home that's priced at 300,000 potentially could sit on the market for 84 days. Whereas, you know, a home that is on the 609,000 is on the market for 68 days. There's really no correlation as to how many days it's been sitting on the market for. And so if you're a seller, don't come in with these high expectations that your property is going to sell quickly. And if you're a buyer, don't be skeptical about the property that's been on the market for a while already. Exactly. Sabrina, as we look at the total properties on the market right now at 289, with the median price of 459 knowing how things have been trending, what should a buyer do now? They need to buy now. It could inflate another 14%, and if that's the case, then the buyer really needs to buy now to really capture this market the way it is this current median price. Our featured property of the month is 34 Connor Way. And Sabrina, you know a little bit about this house. I do know about this house. It is three bed, two bath, 1,364 square feet. It is on 0.19 acres. It backs up to BLM land and has amazing views. It's about seven minutes from town. Um, and as you can see, it is just adorable. Oh, it's cute. I like the, uh, the gray touches, especially the backsplash back here. Nice functional horseshoe kitchen. This is great. And you can tell that they're ready to move. <laughs> they are definitely motivated. So that is your October market report for Gardnerville Minden Topaz for October 2018. And with the holidays coming up, so many things up and down Main Street, right Sabrina? Absolutely, there's really too many events to name. We've got Santa, we've got Christmas lights, we have parades. We have Christmas shopping on Main Street Gardnerville to keep all of that business local. Um, yeah, so that's what we've got going on this Supp Christmas season. Support the small businesses. Definitely uh, help out the mom and pop shops. Well, for more information about uh, any of the market data that you've seen today, you can contact Sabrina at the information you see on your screen now. Hopefully you found all this information very helpful, and you'll give it a like and a share on your social media as well. For Sabrina Karstensen, for the Nevada Real Estate Group at Keller Williams Group 1 Inc. in Reno, Nevada, I'm Philip Goodman. We'll see you next time. Bye.